What is up guys this is Karan here welcome back to Tech Karan YouTube channel and this video we have installed the Pixel Experience latest build on our Redmi Note 8 and Pixel Experience is one of the greatest ever custom rooms available based on Android version 10 for a lot of devices it's available as official build and unofficial build for a lot of devices I'll provide you the link for all the devices which are supported for the official build in the description so if you need that you can download that right now I'm gonna share with you that which are the features you get in Pixel Experience Custom Room why it is one of the smoothest and best ever build to use it on your device make sure to watch this video till the end let's get started okay so first of all as this is a pixel experience room which means you got the pixel launcher pre-installed just go to home settings you got some pixel features here nowadays almost every room which is based on pixel almost every room which is actually aosp it's like just based on pixel experience they got all the pixel options some pixel launcher and some pixel apps and then just add their own features and just release that Pixel experience is actually just the stock room without any single feature. It's just type of thing from Google Pixel devices. Some features which include the Pixel launcher, this kind of Google feed which you get here, go to home settings. Sometimes your Pixel launcher has some extra features like this developer options here too, but sometimes they don't get this, but you can enable these developer options if you want to. And you can enable the things whichever you like, you can choose those things if you want. To. Talking about the good settings panel as this does not have that much feature so just click here you'll get the main functional tiles available here which includes the mobile data, some data saver options, the AOD and volume panel some of these kind of things only nothing extra nothing to customize your quick settings or something like that if you just want to use a room with stock feel, some good battery backup, some performance, you should try out this build for sure on your device because it has almost the same features. It is one of the greatest ever custom rooms. Talking about other things, when you go to styles and wallpapers, you get a lot of pixel wallpapers pre-installed. And this may be available for all the official supported devices too. And one of the best thing is pixel custom room is almost available for a lot of devices some for official runs some has official support but some has unofficial support but nowadays almost every device has pixel experience custom room at least we have some great wallpapers some live wallpapers and some stable wallpapers are available which includes these kind of things you can choose any wallpaper from here and also if you go to styles you have four styles pre-installed you can use these four styles if you want to and they have some icons, some fonts change and some wallpapers change some have and some status bar icon customization also you can choose these kind of things also if you want to and if you are noticing at my status bar this is we have settings running we have seconds running on our status bar with alongside with the clock and some battery indicator is also changed these kind of things you can customize on your device and these are very simple but very useful things if we talk about the camera i have tried to use the gcam 7.4 and you can also use the gcam 7.4 if you want to you can click any photos in hdr and hdr plus enhanced and we have the same features which you had in gcam portrait mode video mode night side you can choose any features from here and these features will work definitely for you as i'm using this on the redmi note 8 and yes gcam 7.4 is perfectly fine i'm using gcam 7.4 by parrot and if you want to use gcam by other developer you can use that's just a point to you nothing matters here gcam 7.4 which i have which i'm using right now by parrot has some great features which includes the google and suggestions social share and some gestures also by the way i don't use these kind of gestures so i'm not sure about that if these are working or not but we have some other features which include disable google photos and save to dc i am camera which means do not create separate folders by saving portrait photos to a shared folder these kind of things you get here disable zoom in portrait mode some hdr plus enhanced settings options are available too which has a maximum auto exposure and if you know what you are doing you can do a lot with this you can also export some xmls from here add some xmls and just increase your camera quality if you want to if we talk about other things as this is one of the great things in the terms of 
performance and stock feel you get this pixel launcher and you can use these kind of recent panel here you can click the clear all button to remove all these things overall it's just super duper smooth it depends upon your device which kernel you get pre-installed so i'm using unofficial build with unofficial kernel also but if you use the official one that will be a stable build for you for sure Talking about the settings, as I already told you some time ago that this is just based on stock room, which means you will not get any extra features available here. When you go to battery section, you won't get the option to enable the battery percentage from here. But yes, you have some other differences here too. You can get some idea regarding last full charge screen usage since the full charge. And you also get the display here, which has the dark theme. You can enable the full dark theme, which actually is global dark mode in Android 10 you can use this one also and click here you can also schedule the dark theme if you want to just like the stock room but with some little bit of extra features from pixel also screen time mode you can adjust you can also adjust the notch behavior if your device has notch you can use the notch behavior too display sound storage privacy these kind of things you get here and if you're using xiaomi's redmi note 8 you get the xiaomi parts available here too if you're using Redmi Note 8 Gingo, I'll provide you the link for this file in the description so you can download this right away as it is one of the greatest rooms ever in the terms of stock experience. You should try out this build for sure. Some little bit other options include gestures, buttons and status bar. And which is the best thing about this thing is if you're noticing there is nothing blank space around after alongside around the keyboard which is one of the greatest things and which was one of the main headaches while using the Android 10 base room still now. You get some blank space here but you can hide the pill and the blank space will be gone and this is all from today's video. I hope you like this short and simple video regarding Pixel experience and if you want to install that, I'll provide you the link in the description. This was all. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.